How can we sing the song of the Lord while in a foreign land? That'll be our our focus this coming Sunday for our Reformation Sunday here at Sola Fide. And in our first lesson is the account of Daniel in the lion's den. Now we know that the the command to to only pray and only worship the the one God of Babylon was not one that, that Daniel could abide with. But what Daniel did and, and what we, we see in these words that we'll read on Sunday was to simply follow his, his regular habit of putting himself in the hands of his God and trusting in God's promises. We read just a few verses from Daniel chapter 6, not, not the exciting part of God delivering Daniel from the lions and the den, but, but Daniel's response to the persecution itself. We read, Now when Daniel learned that the decree had been published, he went home to his upstairs room where the windows opened toward Jerusalem. Three times a day he got down on his knees and prayed, giving thanks to God, to his God, just as he had done before. This is the word of the Lord. We say thanks be to God. We pray, Write your blessed name, O Lord, on my heart, there to remain so indelibly engraved that no prosperity, no adversity shall ever move me from your love. Be to me a strong tower of defense, a comforter in tribulation, a deliverer in distress, an ever-present help in trouble, and a guide to heaven through the many temptations and dangers of this life. We pray these things in Jesus' name. Amen. May God continue to bless your week.